Don't show how I'm some angry Asian kid wearing some deep <laughs> Bluetooth glasses to start with. But anyways, let's begin. The BBC, the British Broadcasting Corporation. <sighs> what the f is going on with the BBC nowadays? I mean, they are trying to get some awards, trying to get some out of viewers. I know they're not doing any commercial breaks, but but did they want to say, you know what, that watching the BBC? No, just no, just I'm not watching. I'd rather stick to ITV. I'm just see that. I'm like, why? I mean, honestly, just now the BBC have just brought Cocomelian, some kind of American kind of sh kind of nursery thing for babies. I mean, like, what the hell is this? You know what? I thought the BBC was going to be more like, oh, you're watching EastEnders, oh, you're watching Doctors. I mean, this is just absolutely garbage, this. And then the CEO of the BBC made me say, like, oh, let's just make the BBC for children or little babies even more Stupid, eh, lad? Because guess what? They even stole Channel 5's milkshake show, Feynman Sam. How stupid is that? It's owned by Channel 5 or Milkshake, whoever the f they are. And now the BBC are just trying to steal Feynman Sam from Channel 5. Absolutely disgraceful, disgusting, and despicable. And get this! The BBC decides to even add more petrol to the fire by adding little baby <laughs> bum! Honestly, they're adding little baby bum to see BBs! Honestly, the BBC are an absolute disgrace! Honestly, disgrace! And guess what? The BBC even stole Top Gear from BBC2! Okay? They just stole it away from BBC2 and put it on BBC1 instead because of their damn safeguard license fee. Who even gives a about that? Honestly, Tim Davy, you thought you could be the best CEO of the BBC, but you've got to go. You've ruined preschool programming. You've put Cocomillion on. you put Little Baby Bum on. you even stole Fireman Sam from Channel 5. And you even had to put Top Gear away from BBC2 and on BBC One for good. Honestly, Tim Davy, let the door turn out. Go on, get out, and don't come back. Honestly, Tim Davy has much identity as Greg Dyke. Absolutely sick of it. Absolutely sick of this. Absolutely sick of this bull. Honestly. Tim Davy is a little bit more like the FIA race director Michael Massey, who was sacked by the FIA and for good reason for ruining my Christmas last year. Absolutely sick of this. Sick of this crap. I'm sick of this. Absolutely. When I meet him, I want to grab this rock and I'm going to. Here. I'm going to grab this rock and smash him into his face like this. You don't even know what you're doing. You're a lost soul, mate. An absolute lost soul. Honestly, look what you're doing to me. I'm sick of it. I'm done. Finished. I've had enough. Honestly, I'm sick of it. I've had enough. Honestly, BBC, just do me one favour. Just get these stupid... Children's stuff off your CBB program and bring Top Gear back to where it belongs and it's BBC Bloody 2. Okay? Honestly, I'm sick of it. There's so much dead wood in this company, I could start a bonfire. Exactly. They don't have any advertisement breaks because there is none. You just think I'm some kind of a joke. Well, I'm not. Do you understand me? I am not. I'm too angry to do this. I'm sorry.